But the real story, I think, which is not known, is the green hydrogen story. We are, I think, the only country in the world which has awarded tenders of this size. Um, I think one of my companies awarded a 10,000 uh, uh, ton green hydrogen uh, thing for in your Panipat plant, one by an Indian company. Then another company, I think, uh, is it HPCL? HPCL has uh, gone a slightly smaller tender, which um, a company in Abu Dhabi has won. But you know, if they uh, can get this done, but the good news is the price is coming down. Earlier, I used to be told, you know, green hydrogen is the energy of the future. Why? All you need is sunlight, sunshine, and an electrolyzer. And then all it produces by way of um, emission is water vapor. So I used to say, Kuni Vantaji, price is high here. When I first spoke to the US Energy Secretary, she said we must do one for one for one, which is one kilo for one dollar in 10 years. So when I looked around, the lowest price then was what, five and a half dollars? It was then. Now the IOCL tender has come below four dollars. I think so, and the HPCL tender has come even below that. Now, tell me if we can replicate this and have more and more green hydrogen used in our refineries and we bring the price, say, below $3, won't there be public um, pressure to say you spend $150 billion on, you know, imports of energy every year, why don't you give some of that money and raise the green hydrogen profile? So, so great things are happening there, some of which we have not captured.